Hello and welcome to my channel Shifa's Kitchen. Today I am going to show you how to make mutton shami kebab. So let's start here. I have 250 grams of mutton. Then I have salt to taste. 1 teaspoon of cumin powder. 2 teaspoon of coriander powder. Half a teaspoon of garam masala powder. And we'll need 1 egg. Then we'll need 3 to 4 red chilies dried. Then I have 1 fourth cup of Bengal gram or chana dal. Here I have 1 small onion finely chopped, finely chopped green coriander, 2 green chilies slit and 1 teaspoon each of ginger garlic paste. So let's start. In the cooker I will add mutton. Then to this I will add red chilies dried. Bengal gram or chana dal, ginger garlic paste, all our spices, cumin powder, coriander powder, salt and garam masala powder, to this I add onions, green chilies, mix it, then to this I will add almost half a cup of water don't add a lot of water or else you won't get the right consistency for the kebab cover it with lid and then we will let it cook as you can see our mutton is done now I'll transfer it into the mixer. And then we'll process it and we'll make it a smooth mixture for the kebabs. Our kebab mixture is done and you, you can see the consistency in it I have added one egg then to this I will add finely chopped green coriander mix it and then we will mix it with the kebab then I will take a small piece of the mixture and then give it a shape of a kebab like this And it is done. I'll do the rest. I have heated up the oil in a pan. Now I'll fry my kebabs. If you want, you can dip the kebabs in the egg and then fry it. I don't like the kebab having the coat of the egg, so I don't dip it. Also, you can skip adding the egg in the mixture. And you can make directly the kebab without the egg. Now I'll fry it. Now I'll flip the kebab. I will let it cook. Our kebabs are done. I'll remove it on a plate. Make sure to shallow fry the kebabs. As you can see, the kebab is looking yummy and delicious. Mutton Shami Kebab is ready. If you like my video, please give a thumbs up. Do like and share. Do comment. If you recreate any of my recipes, don't forget to tag me on any of my social media accounts, Facebook and Instagram. Subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload a new video for yummy recipes. Thank you.